they can hardly wait to inspect their new home at London Zoo, it's been specially designed for them. An 800 square foot enclosure, landscape to provide the sort of surroundings the otter delights in. Imported from Canada, the two otters are called Apollo and Lunik to commemorate those achievements in space. They're certainly one of the most attractive small mammals, and even though they may be the bane of fishermen, it seems illogical that anyone else should really want to hunt them. Many of us who enjoyed reading Ring of Bright Water and Taka the Otter have wanted to keep one as a pet ourselves. But be warned, they have a natural inclination to chew up all your furniture. Only five people are known to keep them as pets in this country and few will have got to know the animal as intimately as Vivian Taylor. Down in her lonely cottage on Dartmoor, she keeps the five otters she bought last year in Malaya. Since then, she's been getting them accustomed to human company before a film is made about keeping these animals as family pets. She's chosen two of them for special star grooming. They're already so tame she can take them for walks and let them off the lead for a swim. What's more, they'll come out when she calls them. David Rook, who is writing the book from which the film will be made, is continually studying their behaviour. They've settled down quite happily with the cat, but earlier on, David and Vivian were both quite badly bitten. These pictures of an otter playing with the cat are among the most unusual ever filmed. Mm -hmm. 